The Minister of Environment, Dr. Mohammad Abubakar, has frowned at the practice of open burning of seized contraband items by some government agencies. The minister said this in Lagos while responding to questions at the opening of a two-day regional sensitization workshop on climate change for the Southwest. He said the practice was inimical to the fight against practices that feel the effects of climate change. Around the world, sometimes I will see this big heap of uh, elephant tusk being burned, maybe uh, Kenya, Kenya, Thailand, places like that. I don't think it's the right way to dispose of uh, contraband. I agree. Uh, just about, uh, I think last week, I watched that, uh, the custom burning that, and I cringed when I saw, you know, the fire going and the black smoke and everything. And, oh yeah, there are all the GSGs and whatever that we are trying to stop uh, from going up into the atmosphere. What well, we have to find a way. Whatever they are burning, there are a lot of things that can be recovered, that can be reused, can be recycled, or turned into energy, or turned into uh, uh, some other resources. Because there are a lot of boxes in this. And it's not just the, the custom. Even the uh, NDLA, they burn some of these drugs. So we have to find ways to remove, to separate the ways. I mean, it's another process entirely, but I think for the benefit of the environment, we should do that. Uh, extract what can be reused, and then find a way, even if we cannot burn it, find some ways that you can encapsulate and landfill it. Even though we run away from landfilling because of leachate into the groundwater, but uh, there are ways that you can do some of these things safe. Abubakar said Nigeria cannot afford to be left behind global efforts aimed at limiting the effects of climate change. Hence, individuals and organizations must make conscious efforts in contributing their quota. Whether we like it or not, we have to support it. Why? Because time will come when nobody will buy the oil. So we better start transiting now. We better start thinking of ways to change the direction of our economy that is so much dependent uh, on oil.